Okay, in this particular video, I'm just going to talk about some of the tools we use for metrics, measurements. Um, there are many uh, tools that are out there that you could actually use to automatically um, test your source code for um, for the different kinds of metrics we talked about in the previous video. video. Um, so from Macab and Associates, you have the visual quality tool set, the visual testing tool set, the visual re-engineering tool set. And these tools can actually test all of these metrics that and some of them we were talking about in um, or, uh, in the previous video, such as the Macab cyclomatic uh, complexity, the essential complexity, the design complexity, uh, the lines of code, Halstead metrics. Uh, CCC is one that you can use on C, C++, Java, other A395 um, and you can get a uh, lock out of it, Macabs, um, something called the CHK suite and it actually generates HTML and XML reports. This is a free program, you can actually download it from SourceForge. I've, I've actually used this in the past with some success and you can actually run your source code through it and um, get uh, some complexity measures out of it. Uh, JMetrix is another pro popular um, program you can use. Uh, usually um, does object oriented metric calculations for Java. Um, requires at least Java 1.2 or above. Uh, it gives you things such as the lock per class, the cyclomatic complexity and um, LCOM. It's distributed freely under GPL um, and it looks uh, something like this. It, see, it gives you a nice little GUI with um, some of your uh, complexity um, measures all, all for you. Gen++ is the next one um, we could use. Uh, this is used specifically for C++ programs and uh, also is again freely available. Uh, you can get a whole bunch of different tools on the internet. Uh, don't be limited by the ones that are showing you in this particular video and you can use this to automatically um, test uh, the complexity of a lot of the programs that you will be writing. So I think that's about it for this particular video. Okay, tune in for the next one. Bye.